morning guys welcome to today's video today's video is sponsored by our mushrooms I ran out of grass so I ran out of gas so I haven't been able to cut this grass down here I keep forgetting to tell Sammy needs to get me gas don't eat them Those are we have Elizabeth still in the house yeah. Penny just oh you're hungry <laughs> okay we're coming the girls have camp today last day of camp so sad you guys saw ollie if you watched yesterday's video you know he's still hanging around which is so good so basically so if you didn't see this if you did yeah if you didn't see yesterday's video sophie did a mistake on willow's hair i'm gonna cut it all off no don't cut it all off just trim the last bit so that it matches the other bit okay that toy has got to go are we um roasting them? I don't know. I think it's too late in the season. Perfect. Just make the back part match the front part. Yeah, I trust you. Oh, okay. I won't. Oh, I won't make it all. You don't all trust me. All right. So if there's any mistakes, <laughs> it's all on you. So Gracie just had her 11th birthday. You guys, she's 11 now. Just a young girl. Just a young pony. Looks, oh, she needs to finish her grain. She's like, you took me away from my grain to cut my hair. She likes so, it out of her mouth. Is this the other side, though? What's the other side? Did you? Long. It's long? I don't think she cut the other side. I <laughs> one short side, one long. So you can see where Elizabeth cut it at the back, and then the only reason it's, like, really puffy up there is because it's slick. But you know what? Every year on the Day by Day Farm, we're going to have a crazy-haired pony. Every year till we learn how to cut hair. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get ready. Take our girls out. You ready to go? I love you to eat. All right, well, let's get the rest ready. You ready, Freddy? Yeah. Yeah, you're my girl. Look at, she's got dirt on you. You got dirt on you. I did so much brushing you yesterday. I'm gonna eat now. Yeah, oh well. All right, let's go. Let's go, because we gotta go to camp. We're almost ready. First Willow, then Gracie. Oh, she rolled. And then Penny Pickle, who knows the drill, never tries to go without me. I know, that happens to me too. So Sophie found out yesterday that her horse that she's riding at camp is pregnant. So Sophie's nervous to ride now because she does not want to ride a pregnant horse. But when a horse is just early pregnant, they it's just the same as they're fine. You can ride her. Yeah. But like, wow, Penny be looking around. She's like, I'm going for the good stuff today. And Willow's looking at her. See how they how they follow her? Like they pre pretend like they're not paying attention. But they, uh oh. The heck? Uh oh, where's your dog? That is not good. We lost the dog. We lost the Dalmatian. It's supposed to rain again today, which is annoying because I really have a lot of things I need to get done, especially because we have a show in two days and we have lessons tonight. So definitely annoying, but we need the rain. But And the rain is gonna bring colder temperatures. So when we go to Trillium on Sunday, the weather is gonna be a lot better. We won't all die. So. <laughs> This is amazing. So we're at camp, dropping the girls off, and I, you got to tell them the story. Will you tell them the story? Will you tell them the story? I'll tell them the story. I, I, okay. I, I like to be private. All right. So you guys know that we've been blessed in this barn for like the last two years on our channel, and one little girl saw it, and her parents surprised her and drove her all the way here so she could go to camp. Well, so she could have a ride here at this barn, and she's getting to go to camp with the girls. So, can I video you? Yeah. So, this is Natalia. How old are you, Natalia? 11. Do you ride horses? Yes. That's awesome. What Do you do you have a horse or you just ride at a barn? I just ride at a barn. Well, that's the same. It's just mm. as good. <laughs> well, that's amazing. And how, you're far. How many hours are you? Do you live from here? Three Two hours. And a half. Two, Two and a half hours. Oh, that's amazing. You guys win parent of the of the year. Like, I'm and not even joking. We're going for a trail ride together afterwards. Oh, that is so awesome. Yeah. That's amazing. You're gonna love it. You're gonna be Yeah, I haven't been on a horse in fifteen years. So oh, you can you'll love it. Guide help, Mom. Yeah, oh that's amazing. That's amazing. 
Okay, not gonna lie, that's amazing. Like, that was amazing. Imagine your parents, imagine you see a place on a video and then your parents just surprise you by taking you there. Like, that's, that's amazing. Anyway, she's gonna go to camp today with the girls and then her mom and her are gonna go on a trail ride after. Parents of the year, honestly. I believe that. Like, I hope a lot of you guys are able to come to this barn. It's not like anything you've ever seen before. Like, I can't describe it. The lady has energy for days. She has motivation. She wants to do stuff and there, it's just incredible. All right, we're headed back. I didn't vlog because I was on uh, in a race to get the house cleaned. I've been able to clean the house two days in a row without Sophie there. How, how does that happen? I had to clean the barn, I did the dishes, clean the house, did the laundry, and now we're headed back to pick up the kids, the girls. But anyway, I wanted to suggest something. I was thinking something. What do you guys think about having a day fam day at that farm? Like what if we did like a day camp day, because she does that, what if we did a day camp day with all of our subscribers that want to come? So if you live in Ontario anywhere and you think that you could come and we could make a day and we could all go and have like a fun day there and like play on the horses and swim and do all the stuff just like that girl did today and came and rode with, the, with Sophie. So what do you guys think? Is anybody interested? If you are interested, let me know. Maybe send me a message on Instagram. And if there's enough people, like six or seven people, I'll try and book it. And we'll all get together and have like a day fam horse day. Like, I think that would be fun. I told Sophie she has to swim today. And if she swims today, I'll let her come back next year with, with her friends again. So I'm going to go down and spy. There's a rooster. He's like, you're too early. I don't hear them. So they have this little cottage here. And I assume they're making it into like a cottage that you could rent. You can even camp here. And you can swim in the water in the horse's pond. Looks like they maybe were already swimming. They even have lights to light the pond up at night. That's super cool. For me... This is what summer is for. This is what summer is about. This is what being a kid in summer is about. For me, it's about them coming out here, going someplace with a bunch of friends and experiencing amazing things. Like to me, summer just started and it's already been so successful for Sophie. So since we have comments back, comment below and tell me what your plans are for this summer. What are your plans? How are you gonna live it up and experience amazing things? while the weather is warm. Come here. The lady who owns this barn, Camilla, said that the chipmunks are taking over the barn. And I just saw two of them poke their heads out of there. We went up the hill and trainer won. He just went up. Trainer is the fastest? I would have known we were racing. I would have pushed him a little more. So you raced? Oh, you weren't racing. Just Molly was racing? Yeah, yeah she's that. like me. That's me. so fast though. That's probably the fastest I've ever gone. And we've gone pretty fast. Yeah, that's amazing. What a, what a crazy feeling, right? That's Where did you race? Where did you? Uh, just up the, one of the hills. Exciting. Are you swimming? Yeah. What happened to your eye? What? What happened to your eye? Sunburn? Probably a... Um, Bug bite? Yeah. All right, are you swimming? Yeah, I just I need a saddle rope. All right. Okay. All right, Elizabeth, how was it? Good. How did you come in the race? Molly was racing. Yeah, were you? I was at the front. Were you at the front? Yeah, I think she's near the back. Was, did Sophie's horse race today? Um, She was behind me, I think. She didn't keep up, she said, but she did pretty good. And then we also jumped at cross, cross country course, which was fun. Did Sophie jump? <gasps> <laughs> I said, come on, Sophie, but she didn't want to. I know. She needs a mean mom there to make her. <laughs> Sophie's going to swim. She went up those hills and down those sand hills. Like she didn't jump, though. And she jumps. That's what her... Okay, go. I, ha I did jump today. Oh, did you jump today? Yeah. Oh. It's not in the jumping field. Oh. All right. It's so refreshing. It's going to be terrifying. No. It's not. That's my favorite saddle, too. That's the Australian stock oh, saddle. It's and it's... Uh, I love that saddle. It puts my feet in the right position. And it has knee rolls, which I love. Joy, yeah. just flying in there. All right, Sophie. Don't make me come after you. Get in there. She's nervous. I can see her. She's going to go. She's going to do it. It's freezing, they said. Oh, there she goes. She's 
doing it. At least she challenged herself and she finally The coming up will be the hard part. She's really leaning back. But look at you! Oh, your horse is good. Get in there, Sophia. And Sheila. This is so good. Like when I come for my trail ride, I do not want to do this unless it's really hot. Oh, get in there, Sophie. Sophie's horse is having a drink. Listen to the laughter. We need to go now. I like they're just like just about to step in the pond. Oh, whoa! Friends are leaving. Whoa! Wait a second. We have to go very pretty back. See, look at how they move. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so that's the subscriber. It's a sad day. The camp is over. It's a sad day. Natalia, what horse did you ride? <laughs> Saffron. saffron. Oh yeah, that's right. You told me earlier. Yeah, she rode saffron. You like her? Yes. Sophie, have you rode saffron? Yeah? No. Oh, no? Oh, the only horse I've ever ridden here is Pia's. I've only ridden this one and La Roca. That one? I've ridden this one and Pia. She came for Sophie's... <laughs> but you came far for it. You guys know my bridal that I got for Mother's Day? This is where I got the idea for it. All these guys have colored bridles and these same reins. These are the fa my favorite reins. They're rubber and they have these bumps and they're small. I love small reins and I like them. I I'm a trail riding girl. Yeah. Pretty pregnant mare. Pretty pregnant mare. She is kind of grouchy. Yeah, she is a grouchy mare today. Poor all right, camp is done. No, that's time. What do you think? We're going back I love it. So, is this better than like normal horse camp? Yeah. Yeah. So, if you, if you I got pickles. yeah, I can smell them. If you had an opportunity to change your riding lessons to here instead of regular riding lessons, would you? No, it had both. Yeah, it would have both because you have, have a horse. Both too, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's something. Yeah. I would not sell my horse. No, we would never sell your horse. Um, but he also teaches me to sit. Yeah. Like, so it's like one of those things where some people, like me and Joy, choose this over everything. Like this, I, I would never choose to ride another horse again if I had an opportunity only to ride gated horses. And Gabby and Kaylee and Sophie, and they like riding regular horses, but they like this too. All right. It was nice meeting you. A day fam. Did you guys like her? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's really sweet, really fun. Uh, I really liked her. I like meeting you guys. That was amazing. All right, so we came shopping to get a few things because we still have Elizabeth with us. We're going to have hamburgers for lunch. And then we have horseback riding lessons tonight. Oh, my girl is not listening to me. They must not. See, it's nice and cold out. So now I know what it is. It's windy and cool. Come on, Pen. Windy and cool and the horses don't want to go in. It's the heat. When it gets too hot, they don't want to be on the grass. Somebody asked me, how do you know they don't want to be outside anymore? And I can feel it from them. I can tell that they want to come in, but also they meet us at the gate. Penny, it's going to rain. Come on. You guys hear the thunder? She's coming. 
coming. Come here, Willow. Willow, look, I got treats. See, I told you, my girl will always come. Look at her move. She looks good. Uh-oh. That is not allowed, Missy. <laughs> My girl. Yeah, good girl. She's excited. Uh, here. Here, Willow. Did you get wet? You look wet. Are you going to catch her? Just remember that outside she's a little more wild. So I had a little nap. Every once in a while, you guys, things happen and I need a nap. I was out last night late. I was at Kaylee's house. We had a big barbecue for Canada's day, for Canada day, for Canada's birthday. And I had a little nap. I needed it, thank God. Sometimes I feel like I just run so often and so much that it catches up with me. So I had a little nap, but now we're up and we are out. It rained again today. Our arena's wet, but not like, you know how at our barn, it gets to be like a soggy mess and we can't ride. We can actually ride in it. So we have beautiful Miss Elizabeth riding beautiful Miss Gracie. So the reason that I wanted her to ride her a few times is because when Gracie's been sitting for a while, she, she's, Gracie's superpower is bolting. That's what she does when she's fresh and when she's, and when she hasn't been ridden for a while. And so that's obviously not something I want my grandkids to experience. So Elizabeth is the perfect person for her. I really believe it. Like she's a little tall, but Gracie really seems to respect her because she's kind and she's quiet. And it's amazing. I, I love watching her. her lots of treats because she did so good did. tell the people of the internet what do you think of Gracie I love her she's really good she responds well to what I ask her like if I want her to walk she walks and even if she goes a little speedy she still listens and I yeah so she likes how how well she responds to people and and not how responsive she is mm -hmm. in meaning like if she squeezes she yeah. goes but how she actually relates to people, right? Like she mm -hmm. listens to you and she respects you as a person. And yeah. yeah, she's phenomenal. Like you guys know how she always comes up to us and wants to be with us and all that stuff. That translates to her in the saddle. Like she's a superstar pony. Yes, yeah, she is. We just need Elizabeth to not grow anymore and we need her to come more often. Yeah. Don't you know that you're beautiful?